All right, scrappers, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we got these uh, fans and they've got uh, aluminum, cast aluminum bodies on them. And uh, I'm gonna show you how we take those apart. But as we get into that, why don't you go and check out my channel page? I mean, not like right this instant, but as soon as you're done with this video, go check out my channel page. We got over 180 videos on there that you could just binge watch. Every Saturday morning, you could eat, you know, Chips Ahoy cookies and chocolate milk and, and binge out on my videos. It'd be so cool. And I'd really appreciate it. These here, we gotta find a, a screw or something underneath this label to get this motor out of it. There we go. It looks like I can punch that right out of there. So let's, uh, let's give that a whirl, huh? Maybe I can do it right there. Maybe I can do it right off that. And that don't fit in there. So how about this little one? Okay, that got rid of that. And that uh, piece of steel aluminum is like just stuck right in there. So I'm gonna throw that right into shred. And it's got a little motor here, two screws on it, holding it in. So yeah, that should pop out of there other than this wire on it, which is like tucked in here. There we go. Now this here is uh, cast aluminum. I don't think the yard should holler because of that sticker on there. There's a little piece of plastic in there that we should probably take out of there. Don't want to give them any excuse to try to downgrade you. There, that came out easy. So, oh, now that's sticking there too. So we got to go back to our punch and punch that out of there. It might be hitting the table. Try it up here. Oh, there, it punched right out little piece of steel there yeah that's steel into that bucket so that wasn't bad it's not real heavy but it's cast clean cast and I missed ha I can't even hit a bucket from a foot away all right put that in shred let's see if this one's the exact same because uh, I recall right I did a different one and it was different that's well, kind of looking like the same one. There. All right, shred. Probably getting you sick with the way I'm flipping my head around here. Kind of chilly today. Yesterday I goofed off. We went golfing at Whispering Springs down in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin. What a beautiful course. You walked on the tee box and it was like you were walking on carpeting. It just, you just kind of almost sunk right into them. All right, clean uh, cast there. How about these motors? Are they gonna be copper? They kind of feel heavy, heavier than you would think for just that little bit of steel on them. Yep, they're copper. See if we can uh, see if we can cut these and get them right out of there. I think I cut it all the way through. Now the tricky part is getting in here. Getting there underneath that copper to pull it up. 
with that plastic guard on there. There we go. Pull that right out of it. Oh, we missed a little. Those might not be cut. Maybe they are. Maybe they are. Come on. Uh, don't know if that was cut all the way. Doesn't appear like it was. Get out of there. Come on. Come on. Can't leave you behind. You gotta go to be made into something else. I don't know if it'd pay to take the to take the angle grinder and zip across there. That might be another way to do it. So we can get under there more better. More better, is that a word? Oh, more better. <laughs> You'd think those would all be cut now on the other side. Unless it got stuck in the plastic, the melting plastic. There we go. So, I mean, there ain't a whole lot of copper in it, but I think it was worth the time to mess around taking it out. That shred there. So, yeah, I really appreciate all of you is coming and watching me on the channel. Um, our views have been up. We're gaining subscribers about 20 a day and there's so many videos that people have never seen if they would just go to my my home page and uh, browse through there you're bound to find something in there that'll entertain you sometimes I do sometimes I do intelligent things and other times I do stupid things and sometimes I cut my fingers and yeah so please please check out my home page and and maybe watch the video that's gonna be on screen right now